This year's lighting of the Macy's Great Tree on Thanksgiving Day will have two major changes. The tree will now be at ground level, not on the roof of Lenox Square. As Channel 2's Jeff Dorr shows us, it will also not be a real tree. Tis a good while before Christmas, but now it's official. The Great Macy's Tree will be artificial. Before you get on a rant about sacred Christmas tree traditions. But I think it should be a real tree like it always has been and, um, you know, keep the tradition going. And the sanctity of spruce over PVC. It's always been a real tree, so that's messed up. Let's look at the tradition. This is film of the tree lighting in 1963. Traditionally, it was the Riches Tree in downtown Atlanta. Macy's bought riches and broke the downtown tradition, changing the name and the location to Lenox Square. And it turned out people loved it. What we didn't know in Georgia was other cities with Macy's great trees like this one in San Francisco had already switched to artificial trees that came from this company in Alpharetta, Christmas lights, etc. They know people struggle with the change. Absolutely they do, but I think the technology and the artificial trees are so close to the look of real trees that that's kind of put them over that hurdle. This is the same model Macy's will have, the giant Everest, but Macy's will be 56 feet. True confession, we have always had real trees at our house. Just turned up our noses at fake trees, but I like these. And when we opened our minds, we found others who find that fake is just fine. Artificial, great. It's not the worst thing ever. It will also sit on the ground this year, not on the roof. It turns out all traditions have to start sometime, somewhere. In Buckhead, Jeff Dorr, Channel 2 Action News. So I'm going to co-host the lighting of the great tree with Channel 2's David Chanley. That's Thanksgiving night. You can see it live right here on Channel 2. Our special coverage begins that evening at 6 o'clock. I don't think this is bad at all. Right? It's, just, it's different. Change is good. Well, the real issue, right, is the other tree caused some damage to the building. Yeah, there's issues it, with it. Didn't it fall? One fell last year. One snapped as they were taking it down. So, you know, cut out all the guesswork. People on Facebook, <laughs> though, are freaking out about this. Yeah, well, it's something new and different. So come on out. Let's enjoy it. It'll be okay, folks. On Facebook, our viewers are weighing in on both sides of this story. Some like the change. Some don't. Join the conversation on Facebook.com slash WSBTV. It's like belly buttons.